one, if you're keeping up with my Instagram, you'll notice that my pictures have gotten better because I've got a new camera. It's the Sony A6500 camera and it does very well in low light. So it's very convenient because sometimes when I go out at night, I can take some nice pictures. But when it comes down to videos, it is a little bit shaky. <laughs> so I contacted my friends at Mosa and you guys have seen me review other of their products like the gimbal uh, they sent me before I used it to shoot 360 videos and I asked if they have anything they say yes and they sent me the Mosa Air Cross gimbal so now let's unbox it and take a look A very nice uh, luggage. So on the top there is instruction, the user menu, and inside is the gimbal and stuff. Let me lay it out and go for them one by one. So this is the handle, and there's a. Uh, Free Livium battery inside and that's the gimbal the camera plate and a tripod and the battery charger for the rechargeable battery Now I'm screwing the tripod onto the handle so that it can stand on the table and then I'm going to screw it onto the gimbal. I haven't put the camera on yet but uh, the gimbal is kind of heavy. Uh, I don't know whether it will be better balanced when I put the camera on. Um, and I don't know if this is the best tool for me but we'll see. And then I'm going to use my one cent to tighten it more. And there is a arrow on the side that shows which direction is up, pointing up. So this direction is pointing up. It's a free access gimbal, so I'm going to enlarge the distance here to put the camera in. And on the side, I'm going to tighten it also to adjust it. So I'm balancing the camera. If not, it will put too much stress on the motor and you don't have to do it every time but for each camera, you have to do, do it once so that you know the gimbal is balanced. Okay, now let's turn it on. I mean, it feels pretty nice, but it's kind of heavy for me. I won't be able to do it for a very long time, but for normal size people, I think this will be okay. This will be not be a problem. And this is very smooth. 
Oh, they also give me uh, some other handles. Now let's try those also. So this is what's in the box and this is the other handle. Oh, this is a lot easier. I can definitely do this for a little while. Before we go out and try that, I want to show you one of the accessories. It's pretty neat. It's the remote control. Yeah, it's the Mosa Fun controller. I could definitely use this to uh, aim the camera for my workbench. And there is other pretty neat function. Let me show you. So now you don't have to use the giant stick to control it just move with the remote control this function is pretty neat i just don't know what i would do with it maybe mount it on the head or mount it on the uh, handle but i will find a way to do uh, make something cool with it actually there is an app comes with it also you can download the app and there are a lot of functions but my friend is coming and uh, we are going out and test this and he's gonna help filming me and we will see how the video comes out.
I really like how the videos came out. It looks very really professional. To be honest, I'm just a vlogger. I probably don't need something this professional and this is very really big and serious. Uh, it is kind of wasteful for my stuff, but I have a friend, she is a film student and I think this will be more useful for her. And if I need it, I just borrow it from her once a month or so. And uh, I think for someone who is a professional, we will appreciate this more. Uh, but uh, also I talked to uh, Mosa. They say they are going to send me a smaller gimbal. So that maybe that will be a little bit more suitable for me, for a vlogger. We will see. I'm going to show it to you next time. In the meantime, please subscribe and thanks a lot for watching.